Good morning and welcome to Glamour's Kitchen. Father, we thank you for waking us this morning because God is all day long every day. Now this is what I don't already put my cream cheese in here and creamed it. And I'm making a key lime pie to start with. And um, I've uh, just grated my lime a little bit. Just getting a little zest, lime zest. And that's going to give us that real good lime flavor. I think I got enough. Let me do this one a little bit. My limes ain't too good, but I'm going to get what I can off of them. I think that's enough. Okay, then I'm going to get the juicer. And I'm going to juice my lime. Dorothy's trying to get my back and all that. No, showing all my fat back. Uh -huh. Trying to show all that. That's why when I get through doing that, I'm going to take a picture of her fat ass. But, uh, <laughs> but, uh, Sue Chef is I'm actually, not worried about it. Sue Chef, she got all that hiney hand back here. Now she know I ain't, got, I ain't working with very much ass. But she got all of it moved out of the way. And, uh, sliced my lime. And, uh, that's Glamma over there. Talking about be quiet. So, catch the juice. And see, I got my uh, vanilla flavor in here, too. And you use a can of, uh, um, sous chef, what is this called? Sweet, condensed sweet milk. And that's all you need. This is easy. It's the easiest pie in the world to make. Because your limes is going to give it that lime flavor. And I don't think you got about, enough. And all you talking about, I think I made them about three of them. I ain't making them with one pie. Well, they, they like to over make stuff. Overdo stuff. This is my first time doing it. Let me do this one, and then if it turns out good, then I'll do another one. Cut that one, too. I don't even think I need three lines. You better put that stuff in there. Or you have a make a taste to it. Mm. Mm. Get all that out of there. I think that's enough juice right there. Mm -hmm. I'm going to take that over and make me a lemon with some lime juice. No, oh, yeah, that's enough lime juice. I'm going to use that one for something else. Let me get my beater. She might want to show you my little bug. <laughs> my auntie crazy. Whew. We have so much fun in this kitchen. Now, one thing I don't like is this thing right here. Give it here. Give me this thing right here. Long. She's opening up my condensed milk. Good morning, Glamma. Mama, again. Let me clean you up there. Get your mouth all wiped off. She's got some cereal, some oranges, bacon, and boiled eggs this morning. And this is the crust. I'm mean, the crust is already ready-made graham cracker crust. And uh, okay, here you go back to me. <laughs> oh boy, I love cooking. <laughs> I, now I'm gonna be honest. I ain't been too long been store cooking. Because when I was growing up, I didn't have time to cook. I was doing other things. I didn't have time to be getting no kitchen and start cooking. Shoot, I was down the street trying to smoke a Snoop Dogg. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, back then, we was drinking Wild Irish Rose. Trying to get a, a, a swig out of the bottle. You know, I'm going to be honest. I ain't keeping it real. 100, as they say. Put all this in there. 
And this is what the condensed milk looks like. And okay. Yeah, you can take that condensed milk before you have vanilla flavoring in there. It would have been better if I had some lime for a little bit more. And you uh, take your juice, pour it in there, clean up your mess, <laughs> and uh, there you go. You better bring your bowl back away from there to eat. And you want to beat it until it gets time. Get back with it. Hey, what time you here? The, uh, 